Well, if you thought the pro EU media in the UK was out of control, I mean, some of the coverage on the continent is absolutely uh, deranged at times in its pro EU devotion and characterization, or should I say, mischaracterization rather, of Brexit, of the UK's withdrawal from the EU. But of course, as we see the Project Fear Scare stories busted up on almost a weekly basis. Uh, at this point in terms of the scare stories that we were told and actually the Brexit reality that we're now seeing, you know, the UK, for instance, with a record number of job vacancies, that perhaps the penny is starting to drop in the continent as well. Because in terms of the French media, this has been widely circulated on social media. A headline there from RTL, Brexit, it's not the disaster announced, is the analysis from RTL journalist Francois Lenglet and roughly translated, and this is on Google Translate, so the odd word might be wrong here. Francois Lenglet, who's a journalist and economist at RTL, quoting the story is saying, the more time passes, the more difficult it will be for Boris Johnson to go back because basically the economic reality of the United Kingdom is not bad, contrary to what supporters of Remain, those who wanted to stay in the European Union. The country is growing, he says quite honestly. It has returned to its pre-crisis level. As I said, there's been a quite big response to this article uh, from the French, from French citizens on social media. You've had Helen Laporte describing it as finally a bit of honesty and president of the Patriots party, Florian Philpop saying, it's not the disaster it's announced, that's it. And on a radio like RTL, he says, the truth always ends up breaking out. French, don't be afraid of anything anymore. Let's do it, hashtag Brexit. Let's be free, sovereign and happy. So as I said, the, some of the ridiculously one-sided, pessimistic, anti-Brexit coverage, even in the continent now. And of course, we saw that famous uh, German front page from Bill, didn't we? That rattled hardline Remainers to their absolute core uh, when the Germans said, we're jealous of you. Now you've got in the French media, Brexit, not the disaster announced. Uh, whether it be Project Fear that was perpetuated in the UK or across Europe, those taking a balanced view on this can finally see that the anti-Brexit scare stories have now been exposed. I think shows those across Europe that actually at leaving the EU, all of what we were told could or may happen in terms of negative consequences, the fact that it hasn't happened, bolsters Eurosceptic arguments right across the continent. And that's why I think in France, in other countries now, you will see a continuing rise in Euroscepticism to different degrees, of course, but yeah, let me know what you make of this French article, guys. And as ever, I'll keep bringing you the very latest on this and more. So make sure you have whacked this video a quick thumbs up. And of course, as ever, thanks so much for watching.